How is it going, my friends? This is Wayne here once again for Zombie Kids. Welcome to the State of Decay action. This is breakdown level 55. This time it's personal. And right now we're controlling this absolute bad man who's got an awe. Oh, yes. So not only can he direct funerals, I'm just basically saying exactly what I said to close the last episode. <laughs> not only can he direct funerals, this bitch can ride a boat. Do you say ride a boat or do you say drive a boat? I've only ever been in a boat once. That was a fun time. I need a vehicle. That would be great. What? <laughs> Forgot what I was doing. Chili, baby, back ribs. Right, so we want to go to this infestation. We need to clear these infestations. These need to be done. Because I'm sick of Devin Rosenberg going on adventures by himself. So, first things first, we are going to clear the living tits off of these infestations. That is priority. We also need more gear. What do we even need? I think we need more fuel. I think fuel is all we need. So, we need fuel. Let me just have a quick look-see. Around this section, I can't remember. Nope, it is knackered, and that is knackered. So we don't go that way. That is not the way to go. Right, we need to head towards the city of Marshall in order to find some fuel and the few, few, I'd like to say few, con uh, construction resources I need. Yeah, I've got 17, right, so I do need a few more. So hopefully in Marshall I can find a vehicle that's not fucked or stuck on a porch. Oh mate, I really need to deal with those infestations. Barrel. Suddenly barrel. It's not this way, is it? Yes it is. Okay then. And this is the way we go. So we're heading this way, down into the city of Marshall. We'll take this long ass road down, all the way down to here, and there's usually fuel somewhere about here, somewhere. Somewhere about here. So that is our current destination. Hopefully we find a vehicle on the way. If we don't, then, well, shit. It is what it is. Fuel in here sometimes too. Let's go. Let's not go. There's zombies in there. Vehicle first. That needs to be a top priority. We do not want to lose our sweet-ass funeral guy. This guy can do everything. He's the perfect guy to have in a zombie apocalypse. Especially if you're sentimental. Me, not so much. If you guys die during a zombie apocalypse when you're with me, then, well, I'm probably going to eat you and then live inside you like Bear grills. I'm not sure, not 100% sure he did that, but I'm sure someone's done that. Lived inside someone else's corpse for warmth during the Ice Age or something. I don't know. I don't really do facts. I do things I read on the internet and then I turn them into my own facts in my head. Right, shut this door. No, we don't shut the door! We don't want to shut the door, we want to get out. We want to get out of the door. Well, I'll just scream like a girl. That was a feral. That feral's followed us all the way here. Right, are you guys going to quake so I can get... You got what? You just like magneted yourself to my vehicle. And then I turned into a squirrel. It's been a weird day. We already had Crucifix Juggernaut in the last episode. Now we've got Magnet Zombie and the really, really persistent Feral. Right, are we good now? Can I get out? Thanks. That'd be great. I didn't bring any meds. What a dickhead. Right, shut this door. Confirmed. We are set free here. Thank fuck for that. Right, here we go. I'm loaded up. See you back nah. in face. Really need a run. It really need a back sack. A back sack. A back sack and crack. I meant a backpack. Not a back sack. Go. Onwards, squatters. Bloaters in the distance. I know many funerals can kill a bloater. Unless they go on and on forever and then the bloater starves to death. But do zombies even need to eat or is it that just the impulse? I mean, what happens? Does anyone really know? Because, I mean, they're not real, so. But if it's anything like the Walking Dead zombies, they just get slightly, slightly more ill looking as the time goes on. Yet they still keep going. Fair play to him. Persistence. Like that feral. Very, very persistent. Right, where's this? How the tits did I not see that? I was looking at my microphone again just to make sure. Right, come on. There's got to be a vehicle around here somewhere. There just isn't, is there? There really isn't. Sometimes there's a there's a taxi cab down this way. Let's attempt to find the taxi cab. 
The taxi cab is not here. Right then. Sometimes there's a police car down this way. Let's attempt to find the police car. Nothing that side. Nothing that side. Oh god, no. Police car, be here. That would be great, mate. Please. Let's be friends. Now, let me drive you. There really is. There's nothing. There is nothing. Nothing, nothing exists anymore. Everything's dead. Police car's normally in this spot here and it's not there. Shit. Right, okay then. Let's go. There's another feral and 76 bloaters. That's exactly what someone wants to see when they're in an alien territory. You have no idea what's going on. There's a juggy as well. More bloaters and another barrel. And still no vehicles. Need fuel, mate. Is that one? No, that one's knackered. That is knackered. Send that to the knacker yard. It is knackered, mate. Right, sometimes there's a pizza mobile down here. Just give me a pizza mobile. I don't even like them, but I'll have one, mate. I will take your pizza mobile, I'll deliver your gimmicks, and I'll steal your car. It's not there. There are no more vehicles in this game, it's confirmed. That's it, we've got them all. And the juggernaut's right where I need to be. The fuel is usually in that building there, and there's a juggernaut there. Of course there is. So, plan B. Wanna head over this bridge. Sometimes there is either a muscle car or a pickup truck over here. I know we're surrounded by infestations, potentially Lily. Lily. There's nothing I can do about it right now. I'm on my way, I'm trying to do my shit, and you're just interfering. Right, there is no car. And? There is no truck. And there's a bloater though. And there's some more damage for me, great. Exactly where I want in this day and age is more damage. Right, let's run over this son bitch. Another bloater, great. I'm just gonna tank the damage, don't even care. I don't know, there was a, a zombie there somewhere. I, was thinking, I, don't, I, don't, I really don't remember killing him. Apparently, the funeral guy is immune to bloaters as well. Look at that, his stamina's just not depleting. Guy's a boss. Right, the reason I'm doing this and sticking around is because there's usually fuel in this building here. And funeral guy is just not taking any stamina damage whatsoever. Oh, man's a ledge. I told you he's a legend. Right, now I need to wait for this fart to go. Shit, we need to get rid of these bitches first as well. It's starting to sound like Dom West because I've been recording all day. My god, Mike. What a sharpshooter. Right, get this bitch down. They're just everywhere. I want to make sure there's fuel, uh, not fuel in this place. If there is fuel, fantastic. It looks like there could be. And it's giving me the option to search. Right, let's get rid. Are we good now? We are not good, but I might have enough time. So let's get up and out and through and search. Quickly, quickly. There we go. Okay, and I'll dibs, I can't grab it. Can't grab it. Right, in and out of here. That is how we do funeral guy. Especially with all these blood in the vicinity. Might as well kill him, considering he's not taking any stamina damage for seemingly no reason. I mean, he should be taking stamina damage, but he's not. Might as well grab those points while I'm here. But, I've glitched over a rock, so now I'm gone. At least I'm gone with a little bit of fuel. Not the most, but could be worse, could have no fuel. I'm glad we got some fuel. Let's check out ye oldy tea party warehouse. This place is always loaded with shit. Horse. Anything at home I should be worried about? Heads up, gang. Scouts are reporting a horde heading our way. Yep, you've looking? got outposts, deal right. with it. We got this one. Deposited, so we've got construction resources in there. We've also got some uh, fuel resources in there now. Let's have a look, see if we can get some more. Okay. Keeping an eye on the door, because I haven't searched in there yet. Nothing. We're good in there. We are good in here. Look at that, some more fuel it's right nice. there. That is a sweet haul. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Right, 
In. Out. Get rid of this guy. Get rid of the blow tape. We got more that just randomly spawned from the wall. Kill you, sir. And you, sir. There we go. Two more down. Might as well, while we're here, have a look for... Oh, dear. <laughs> that is not good. He's literally not taking any stamina damage. I don't know if that's a glitch or if it's just his badassery. Look at that sweet... Oh, shit. We've got an axe in there. I'm taking that bad boy with me. More blow tays coming in. Literally, look at that. I ran through it and he's not taking stamina damage. That's probably a glitch, but I'm going to run with it. Right, let's go. I want to check that again. Grab that. Loaded grab up. that. See you back at base. My favourite heavy weapon. Now in our possession. Other than the big ass wrench. I mean, that thing's boss. There we go. One more for the road. I believe that this is full now. Indeed. Where I can take out the rest of my pie and deposit this inside there. Now, I've got space for one more. Let's just get rid of this blow tag again. I'm going to make the most of that while it's... If, if it is a permanent glitch, excellent. If not, I'm not complaining. This is good, right? Hinges! Hell yes! Welding equipment! Yes! Look at that, we found everything that we needed for our construction projects as well. Good old Marshall. See, you find everything in Marshall. You find absolutely fuck all in Spencer's Mill. But the church is such a cool looking home site, and you guys have been requesting a church run for a hell of a long time. It seemed unfair to deprive you guys of a church run. Juggy in the background. Work my way around there. Now it's easy sailing. Oh yeah. Easy save, providing I don't flip my vehicle. That could happen, it usually does. So let's go hit the road and see what the road brings us. So right now, we've got a legendary haul in the back of this truck. We've got so much gear that that might just be enough for us to move on to level 56. take with us a decent group of survivors as well. I mean, we got Marcus and Ed for one from the main storyline, of course. Marcus Campbell and Ed Jones. Uh, we got this legend right now, funeral director, boat enthusiast. Take him with us. We got the guy that keeps going missing, Devin Rosenberg. Why not? Man's a leg. That bloke is just like following me every step of the way. Well, what's left of him. And daytime is upon us as well. Just noticed that. So used to playing in the dark, I sort of forget when it's daytime again. Just like real life. Little things. A couple of blow tays and a juggy. <laughs> Not really worth it. Let's just keep it going. Not interested, Lily. Not interested. You killed your own army bros while I'm out saving the world and your asses and shit. Infestations still desperately need to be dealt with. No one's gone missing though, which is nice considering I've been out for quite some time. And everyone is still staying put. Somebody's repaired the fire hydrant though, so might as well damage that again. There's a lamppost. There goes my bumper. And there goes the mailbox. All in all, a good day. Stop. Who the fuck are you telling lad? Get out my face, yo shit. Christ. Terrible driving. Wayne shit driving. Heading into 2018 still alive and well. Okay, I'm free and clear. See you soon. Deposit all there of this. Go. Look at that for a I'm whole world. Yes, anything. mate. What you got? Oh, you know. Stuff. Sweet. Deposit these hinges and the other thing. Bingo. There we go. Look at that. Bingo. Fantastic. Classico. That is literally everything deposited now. 
Need a backpack, need a backpack. Not a back stack and crack. Deposit that. So work can continue and those things are done, yeah. Munition shop, I'm getting this achievement. Don't care who I have to offend. In the game, this is it. I'm getting it. 300 rounds of ammunition. And make pie. Oh sweet, you can actually make pie. Yep, gonna do that. Uh, right, snipe zombies. Get that done, biatch. And I'm gonna offer shelter because I've got bear influence. I've got so much influence I can shit it out. These need to be dealt with. ASAP, quick smart, etc. Right, gonna pop me some children's tube of painkillers. Gonna take me out some aspirins. I've got my ore. I'm gonna go and clear some infestations. Ooh, I've still got something in there. I think it's the thermite, actually. Yeah, I'll keep that in there. Right, that one first. I've had my eye on that bad boy for a long ass time. Time to get it done! So I'm heading towards the infestation and we've got another horde heading into our safe zone circle that will deal with that without us having to. That's the benefits of outposts. Speaking of which, I could definitely do with another outpost. Maybe this building here. A shitter. That'd be a great place to have an outpost. That's a wall. Did not look at the wall. Ah, right, well that excellent glitch is over. Because I'm taking stamina damage from the bloat haze again. Oh well, it was fun while it lasted. I definitely, definitely made the most of it. With all the gear I found. Pills. Oh, naughtiness. <laughs> Eat my all, you whore. Knees to faces, yeah. Get my booty in here. Shut this door. Nothing to search at all in here. That really was a bad time for that guy. Right, I'm immune again, apparently. Nope, now I'm back to normal. How's it going back home? New report from our scouts. That, uh, that's a lot of zombies. Look, I'm busy doing other things, bro. Okay. So we've got a scout report coming in, shit's gone down, etc, etc. But I'm busy. Topping meds and eating pie. Get me in here. There we go. Oh. This bitch wants a bathroom time. And she did. Searching for some painkillers, which I'll pop now. A backpack, which I will I equip now. Not a bad haul. Right, now we've just got the middle room to search. I don't even know if you can have the bathroom as a uh, outpost. One way to find out, and that's to try. Rusty pipe, nope. Wouldn't yes, I can. Set up here. In fact, I'm going to take that for a little bit of influence. Yeah, I'm pulling the trigger on this outpost. Sweet. Right, our final outpost is a shitter. Can't complain about that. Oh, shit. Oh, that was nasty. Wasn't looking. Wasn't looking. Need to get back to my vehicle quick, smart. I'm actually being knocked about by the fart gas now. Whatever the reason it wasn't uh, knocking me about before, I uh, no idea. But it is now. That's a tree. That is a tree. That's a bench. That's a bench. Also a tree. Tree. Austin Powers going on. Get me the hell out of here. That is not a way over. And I'm stuck. Right, I'm back. We go. That's what happens when you sit too far away from your television and you're nearly 30. Your eyesight ain't as good as it used to be when you've had 25 years of video games. Had to think when I first started gaming then. Literally 1993, wow. Golden Axe Warrior and Lunar the Silver Star. First two games I ever played. 
Hence my love for RPGs and stuff that goes boom. Right. Think it might be time for a new survivor. Let's head back into the home site and see who we've got left. To actually switch out to who's not injured or got AIDS. So, oh fuck, I was going to switch out to Ed as well. Ed's missing because of the infestations that I've yet to clear. Hurt, 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 knackered. Hurt, 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 Weapons of mass destruction. Four of those bad boys. And then we'll fart on them and make them weapons of ass destruction. Infestations is an essential. Because if Devon isn't going missing, then Ed's going missing. People are going missing. I'm not happy with that. So we need to clear all of these in the surrounding vicinity. Four, eight. There are eight infestations locally that we know of that need to be dealt with. And then that one over there that nobody cares about. But mainly these ones. That one, not so much. So that is the plan. In the next episode, guys, we're going to be dealing with these infestations once and for all, hopefully. Maybe. Unless something else comes up and then we won't. Which usually happens. But I'm going to try at least. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. This has been part number five of State of Decay Level 55. This time it is personal. And when we return, we will be continuing with Level 55. And Episode 6. So that is where we're going. So I shall see you shortly for all of that shit. And then hopefully all the infestations will be gone by the end of the next episode. And so on and so forth. How's the RV going on before I go actually? Let me just... Right, 49 seconds for the RV. So then we can start working on that once again. We bought home bare gear. So we should have enough, hopefully, maybe. Hopefully. Really, probably not. But we're going to have to go out and get more. To move on into level 56 and finally put a nail in the coffin on level 55 that seems like it's gone on forever. So fingers crossed guys, fingers crossed and toesies and all the other things that you can cross. I mean some people can cross the belly button. I've literally seen someone do that and I don't know how. I mean I can't even move my, I don't even, my belly button's not a part of me. It's just knocking about down there and it doesn't really do anything or it, it just looks ugly. I don't know why it's there. But some people can cross them. And that's really shocking stuff. So, I'm still friends with that guy now. Just, my, that's the main reason. I don't really like him that much. Where I mean, I want to know someone that can cross the belly button. So, it, they're all skills that you can use in various situations. That can help you in life. So, yeah. If you can cross your belly button, get in touch with me. Comments below. I'll definitely reply, promise. Especially if it's about belly buttons. Cheers guys, all the best. And goodbye!